Hey, it's Ashley. I have a quick 10 minute core sculpting workout for you today. This is a body weight workout done on the mat, no equipment required. We're gonna be moving through supine, prone, and side lying positions with a spicy finisher. It's continuous movement, lots to pack in. I hope you love it. Hey everybody, it's Ashley from Get Fit with Ashley. I'm here with Bo and Trixie today and welcome to your 10 minute, very quick core sculpting workout. It's only 10 minutes, but we have so much work packed in. You don't need any equipment today. It's a body weight workout and we're gonna be on the mat. Let's get started with a very brief warm up and get to work, okay? What we're gonna be doing for our warm up today are plank walkouts. So I want you to join me at the end of your mat. Let's take your hands and walk out into our plank position. Drop your hips and raise your hips up into pike and walk back in. Good. We're gonna do a couple more of these. Whoop. Trixie's trying to do it too. <laughs> All right, Trixie, good job. Plank, cobra position, up into pike or down dog and walk back in. Today's workout has four sets and a very spicy finisher. All right. We are pretty much moving continuously today. We have 25 second intervals with five seconds in between, which is not necessarily enough time to rest. It's just enough time to transition into the next move. All right, our first moves here today are going to be in the supine position, so join me. We are starting with crunches, feet flat, hands right behind the ears here. Exhale up and inhale down. Now. My most common mistake that I see with my clients is interlacing your fingers and pulling on your neck. No, 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 no. I want your fingertips behind your ears. Do not pull on your neck. Exhale as you come up and inhale as you come down. We're gonna be moving into reverse crunches next. Good. Cross your ankles, hands up, and tuck your bum. Good. Exhale as you tuck, inhale down. I want you to challenge yourself to keep your sneakers as close to your butt as you can. Don't kick your legs in the air. Use your low abs, force your low abs to do the work to lift your butt and low back off of the mat. Okay? Yes, you can. We're moving into oblique crunches next. Feet flat on the floor and we're gonna crunch up and reach to opposite knee. Let's go. We have so much work to pack in here into 10 minutes. That's why only the five seconds to transition. There are four sets and a spicy finisher. Every set has three moves and ends with an isometric hold. Next up is gonna be our isometric hold for this first set. And what we're gonna do, hands up, palms up, and hold in this crunch position. Keep breathing, don't hold your breath. You owe me 25 seconds right here. Keep breathing, relax your shoulders, palms are up, don't touch your legs, and hold. This ends the first of four. We're gonna be moving into the prone position next and doing some plank work. Almost there. <coughs> Excuse me, good. Over into your plank position, we have plank down ups. Forearms and hands, let's go. Down and up. You can do these on your knees if you need a little less intensity at the moment. I want you to alternate the hands and the wrists so that you're go going equally on both sides. Good, stay in your forearm plank. We have a plank saw next up on your toes. Here we go, we rock forward and back. Good, you've got this. This set is tough. It's almost two minutes of planking. You can sit your knees down during that five seconds. Oh, you should be feeling things now. Ooh, okay, we have plank hip dips, rocking side to side, let's go. Eyes on the mat, you don't have to tuck your chin. We're rocking side to side. Keep your bum down. Keep
keep both elbows on the mat. You got it. Rest. Good. And lastly, our isometric is, of course, a plank hold. Ready, go. Hold. 25 seconds. We're going to be moving next into side lying crunches. Okay? For set number three. Stay strong. Woo! Good. Side lying crunches. Shoulder down, arm down, crunch. Good. Can you come up to your hand or your elbow? Oh, I feel the heat building in my core. But hey, we said it was quick. We said it was continuous and it's effective. We have to keep moving. We are on our way, getting to that halfway point. Rest, V-ups are next. We're gonna ask for both legs in the air. Don't pull on your neck, let's go. Exhale up, inhale down. Every down, we come back down to our shoulder. Good. Push up to your hand or elbow. Down to your shoulder. Exhale up, inhale down. You got this. Good, next up, side plank hip dip. I'm up here on my right forearm. Okay, legs are stacked. Let's dip and lift. Good, eyes front. Option here, lower your bottom knee onto the floor. You can still lift and lower your hips from that position. Yes, you can. Rest. And our last one is always isometrics. We're gonna hold this side plank. Let's go. Hold. Just 25 seconds. And we're ready to switch sides for set number four. Woo. Shake, shake. Anybody else shaking out there? Yeah. Who knew? No jumping required. And I'm sweating like crazy. <laughs> Switch sides. Let's get that sideline crunch on your left. Ready? Here we go. Good. Don't pull on your neck. I just have my hand here. I just have my hand, fingertips close to my ear. And I'm leaning my body front as I crunch, chest to thigh. We got this. Good, we're ready for that side lying V up. Ready? Here we go, legs up. Can you keep your legs straight? You're doing great. Woo! Yes, core sculpting, we're getting it all. We're getting all the planes of motion. And we're on our way. Good, side plank, hip dips. Two more moves before we get to that spicy finisher. Ready, arm up, let's go. Dip and lift. I want you to exaggerate. Drive your hips high, chest forward, eyes front. Good. Next up is our isometric move. Just that plank hold. I say just, but. It's serious. <laughs> it's not easy. Ready? Here we go, the 30 seconds, 25 seconds, let's go. Okay, this here, this blank hold, this is the end of the four sets and then we're ready for our spicy finisher, which is one minute. We are gonna be doing bicycles. Four supine bicycles on your back and four V-sit bicycles with your back up, okay? If you need a modification, stay down and bike with your low back on the mat the whole time. Otherwise, up four, down four. Ready? Let's go. Four kicks and up for four. Twist for four. 
and up for four. Yes, you got it. Keep your legs moving in full range of motion. Kick them straight out. We are gonna go for a minute. We're at that halfway point. Ooh, dig deep. We're not done yet. 20 seconds. Come on. Uh, this is how we core sculpt. Oh, we don't quit till we're done. Done. Oh, <laughs> I hope your core feels sculpted. <laughs> A fiery sculpting. Oh, that was tough. Thanks, Trixie, for the support. Let's turn around here and stretch in your cobra position. Feel free to grab a drink if you need one. Nice job, very effective, 10 minutes, abs and core sculpting. Let's go. Let's go into this cobra position, which was part of our warm up. Toes tucked under, drive your hips to the mat and press your shoulders down. Yes, you can. You did it. You can and you did. Oh, thank you, Trixie. Good. Leave me a comment. I'll read it out loud to Bo and Trixie, I promise. Let me know how you feel, how you did. Oh, I'm proud of you. That was 10 serious minutes. And let me know where you're from. Come on up here. Let's arch our back here. Where you're from, and I'll add you to my world map here on the wall behind me. I have push pins for my subscribers. Let's get you on there, okay? Good, arch and curl. Ooh, good. And now let's come to a comfortable seated position, whatever that looks like for you. And let's stretch your shoulders. You did great today. Check me out online, getfitwithashley.com. And I have free workout plans too. If that's something you're interested in, I have them for beginner, intermediate, and advanced level getfitwithashley.com slash plans, and they're all free. They're all free. They come with a nice calendar and description of the workouts and playlist, YouTube playlist. So tell a friend. Uh, we are so happy that you're here. Congratulations, you did a great job today. And on behalf of Bo and Trixie, we hope you'll join us again soon. I'm Ashley from Get Fit With Ashley, and I'll see you next time.